The Machiavellians, Defenders of Freedom, by James Burnham is a seminal work in political philosophy that examines the ideas and strategies of a group of thinkers he dubs, the Machiavellians. Burnham's analysis delves into the complexities of power, politics, and the pursuit of freedom. This essay will provide a literary analysis of key themes and concepts from the book. Burnham's central argument revolves around the idea that the Machiavellians, including thinkers like Machiavelli, Hobbes, Pareto, and Michaels, were, in essence, defenders of freedom, albeit through unconventional means. He contends that their ruthless and pragmatic approach to politics was a necessary response to the complexities of the real world. One of Burnham's central arguments is that the Machiavellians recognized the inherent struggle for power in society and embraced it as a fundamental aspect of human nature. According to Burnham, these thinkers rejected idealistic notions of politics and instead emphasized the importance of understanding and navigating the power dynamics that exist in all social structures. In this view, Power is not inherently evil but a neutral force that can be harnessed for both good and bad purposes. Burnham's analysis of Machiavelli, often considered the archetype of political cunning, is particularly illuminating. He argues that Machiavelli's famous work, The Prince, should not be viewed as an endorsement of tyranny but as a pragmatic guide for rulers to maintain stability and order in a turbulent world. Machiavelli's emphasis on realism and his rejection of utopian ideals are seen by Burnham as an acknowledgement of the harsh realities of politics. Hobbes, another prominent figure discussed by Burnham, is presented as a thinker who recognized the inherent conflict and chaos that can arise in the absence of strong central authority. Hobbes's famous concept of the state of nature is interpreted by Burnham as a thought experiment that underscores the necessity of government to prevent a descent into anarchy. Pareto and Michaels, on the other hand, provide insights into the dynamics of elites and bureaucracies. Burnham argues that Pareto's theory of the circulation of elites and Michaels's iron law of oligarchy reveal the inevitability of power concentration in any organization or society. While this may seem at odds with the idea of freedom, Burnham contends that a clear understanding of these dynamics is essential for those who seek to preserve and defend liberty. One of the key strengths of Burnham's analysis is his ability to contextualize the ideas of these thinkers within the tumultuous political landscape of their times. He demonstrates how the Machiavellians were responding to the challenges posed by the rise of modern nation-states, industrialization, and the erosion of traditional authority structures. In this sense, Burnham portrays them as realists who adapted to the changing world rather than as proponents of a specific ideology. Moreover, Burnham's exploration of the Machiavellians' influence on subsequent political thought is enlightening. He traces the impact of their ideas on figures like Max Weber and Carl Schmitt, highlighting the enduring relevance of their insights in the study of power and politics. While Burnham's analysis is thought-provoking, it is not without its criticisms. Some argue that his characterization of the Machiavellians as defenders of freedom is overly generous, given their often authoritarian and cynical views. Additionally, Burnham's focus on the elite perspective may be seen as neglecting the experiences and aspirations of the broader population. In conclusion, The Machiavellians, Defenders of Freedom, by James Burnham offers a compelling analysis of the political thought of Machiavelli, Hobbes, Pareto, Michaels, and others. Burnham's central argument that these thinkers were defenders of freedom through their pragmatic approach to power dynamics challenges conventional interpretations of their work. His exploration of their ideas within historical and intellectual contexts provides valuable insights into the complexities of politics and the pursuit of liberty. While not without controversy, 
Burnham's work remains a significant contribution to political philosophy and the study of power.